In Edgar Allan Poe's collection of short stories, Tales of the Grotesque and Arabesque, the author delves into the realms of horror, mystery, and the macabre with a masterful hand. Through his intricate narratives and vivid imagery, Poe weaves tales that explore the darker aspects of the human psyche, delving into themes of madness, obsession, and the supernatural. One of the striking elements of Poe's stories is his adept use of symbolism and allegory. In The Fall of the House of Usher, for instance, the decaying mansion mirrors the disintegration of the Usher family line, while the storm raging outside reflects the turmoil within. Similarly, in The Telltale Heart, the protagonist's obsession with the old man's vulturite symbolizes his own descent into madness and guilt. Through these symbols, Poe creates a rich tapestry of meaning that adds depth to his tales. Moreover, Poe's skillful manipulation of atmosphere plays a pivotal role in his storytelling. Whether it's the oppressive gloom of the House of Usher or the eerie silence of the catacombs in The Cask of Amontillado, Poe expertly crafts environments that heighten the sense of dread and suspense. By immersing the reader in these chilling settings, Poe creates a visceral experience that lingers long after the story ends. Another hallmark of Poe's writing is his exploration of the human psyche, particularly its darker aspects. In stories like The Black Cat and William Wilson, Poe delves into the depths of guilt, paranoia, and moral decay. The protagonists grapple with their own inner demons, ultimately leading to their downfall. Through these characters, Poe confronts the reader with the unsettling truth of human nature, forcing them to confront their own fears and desires. Furthermore, Poe's fascination with the supernatural adds an additional layer of intrigue to his tales. Whether it's the spectral figure in The Mask of the Red Death, or the haunting presence of Lygia in the eponymous tale, Poe blurs the line between the natural and the supernatural. By introducing these elements of the unknown, Poe creates an atmosphere of uncertainty and unease, leaving the reader questioning what is real and what is imagined. In addition to his thematic depth, Poe's prose style is marked by its precision and economy. Every word seems carefully chosen for maximum impact, heightening the intensity of the narrative. His use of repetition, alliteration, and rhythmic patterns further enhances the musicality of his writing, drawing the reader deeper into his dark and foreboding world. Overall, Tales of the Grotesque and Arabesque stands as a testament to Edgar Allan Poe's mastery of the short story form. Through his exploration of themes such as madness, obsession, and the supernatural, Poe creates a body of work that continues to captivate and disturb readers to this day. With his vivid imagery, atmospheric settings, and penetrating insight into the human psyche, Poe remains one of the most enduring figures in the realm of Gothic literature.